What's up everyone? I had a uh, request to do a video on how I edit my videos. This is the app I use right here. It's the Power Director app. You can download it for free. There is a um, extended version of it, but you have to pay money for that. It's pretty simple. Um, this is what you're looking at when you start out. You got to go on your videos and um, just one by one start adding the clips. If it happens to be one clip, you just you click on it and you press the plus symbol. You can hit play on any one of them and kind of preview them real quick, which helps if you have a lot that um, have a similar looking thumbnail. You can pretty much add the clips in any order and then you just click on them and once you see the bar pop up, you can um, shift them around to any point in the video and you can also um, shorten them up and stuff. You can basically trim them again from here if you need to. There's a couple ways to add images. You can um, add them from here, the, the little template thing, and that'll add an image that'll just pop up in the background. It won't take over the, um, you can basically keep the video playing and have the little image pop up anywhere on the screen and you can make it as large or small as you want to. You can also click the icon in between the camera up there and the music symbol and that'll give you the option to um, add an image that just takes over the whole screen. It'll have its own little portion and you can actually extend that and shorten it. But this is the audio right here. You pretty much just go into the settings. I was having a little trouble because I was trying to look through the, um, the one phone into the other screen. But you just go into the audio mixing and you turn the one down all the way to the left here. This would be the, the audio it picked up when you recorded everything. And um, you don't want to hear your voice twice and you don't want to hear any background noise that, that might have been picked up originally. As you can see, I recorded the audio in little clips because I make many mistakes. I'm sure everyone does when they're recording the videos. And um, this way you can play it back and see if you like it or not. And um, you don't have to re-record the entire video over again. And once you have everything put together, you can save it or send it to YouTube or Facebook directly. If you don't pay for the app, you, you don't get the full HD. But that's pretty much it, guys. Um, if you have any more questions, feel free to ask. And um, I'm going to try to do some more helpful videos sometime soon. As always, thanks for watching.